Oh, hi, welcome. We are live. <laughs> welcome. Welcome. Um, and my glasses have Earl on them, <laughs> which really sucks. We've been working hard. We have oil everywhere right now. Well, hello, my little chickens. It's Jenny Love, the Rogue Witch from Brew Book and Candle, Two Chicks Bewitched, my fabulous partner, Evie Hart, the other half of the two chicks. There she is. Hello. <laughs> and I, it's still, I have oil. We've been working our asses off today. And hey, Cheryl. Hey, Cheryl Sprague. What's happening? So we were working our butts off today um yeah we were all working week. our butts off we all were working week. our butts off all week for right. this event and uh hey tony how are you lovely we're gonna give some folks a chance to get in and then we'll i'm gonna go clean my glasses with some actual something cleaner and let my partner <laughs> chat with you about the the, the the evening instead of smearing the oil everywhere no, just, that's all i'm doing <laughs> <laughs> so we've been working hard um for the last couple of weeks and then all afternoon since this morning's sound bath. Um, just preparing things, getting things together. Um, some new creations, some old classics, um, most loved favorites. And yeah, we're excited. Um, who, what do we have? We have a whole variety of, we have toners and oils, botanical oils. Um, so infused with all the goodness and lots of love. And uh, we have a couple of whipped body butters, um, some balms, uh, our, our uh, very much loved Calm the Fuck Down, and some new, delicious, sexy, sensual uh, whipped butters. So. All right. Exciting. It's very exciting. Oh, I forgot the baths too. Ooh, oh, we have scrubs. so much stuff going. Scrubs we have and so bath salts and now I, maybe I don't have coconut oil on my glasses. <laughs> All you really do is smear it around. Doesn't really clean it off. Doesn't really do much, and I can't see. Ah, oh, that's pudding little... stone everywhere. Mm -hmm. Pudding stone. Pudding stone is it's a conglomerate rock um found in certain locations that it's been dubbed pudding stone um it's got like it looks almost like a concretion like a fine dense rock mm -hmm. with nuggets of different um included uh minerals and rocks oh, along with it cool it's cool looking it's got a nice pattern cheryl while i'm here to spend money well, we're, <laughs> and we're here to take it thank you very much <laughs> Um, we're here to help you spend it. We're here to help you spend it. So, okay. So a little bit of ground rules for instructions and how we plan on doing this. Um, it gets a little crazy. So I, there's people watching on YouTube. There's people watching on Facebook. And hey, Meg, how are you, honey? How are you feeling? I hope hey, you're Meg. feeling better. Um, such beautiful, luxurious hair, David Ellis says. <laughs> he has to be talking to you. He certainly is not talking to me um well, well why not uh, yeah because i've never that's never been i've never been accused of having luxurious hair um it's making me very hot right now so um it gets a little crazy we have to monitor the feed feeling much better that's good i'm glad hey tina chang how are you honey so we have this you know it's like an automatic feed on the to the you know, right of the screen. I can't get it on YouTube because it's on Jenny Loves YouTube. It's not on Two Chicks YouTube. Right. It's on Jenny Loves YouTube. Right. Jamie, in case you want to go back over. Uh, we all want Aaron's hair. Indeed. Without a doubt. <laughs> so you have to comment. And if we don't acknowledge your comment, we didn't see it. Right. Uh, sometimes people share the feed Ooh. or they host a watch party and then sometimes you're not actually commenting in our feed. Right. Like if you, you can that's share the what video. we were on. Right. So, but a, a watch it party does say that I, so that's me. That's YouTube. That's my YouTube, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. Why? Yes. Yes, it is. Hmm. Right. Interesting. You are live. Huh. Oh. That's interesting. I'll have to check it out. So 
if we don't acknowledge you that you want something, we didn't see it. Right. So we're going to need to have some clarification on that. I just want to check my the YouTube to see if I'm on there. YouTube. Not the studio. We are live. Um, oh, Dina D. Salvatore, will you make a list of what's for sale on your site? I have to leave. Oh, yes. Well, yes, we will be able to do that. You're on our Facebook page. Our website is currently under construction. Dun, dun, dun. Um, oh, shoot. Sorry. <laughs> Volume. Sorry. Um, but we will certainly share everything all over the place. Um, and then on our website once it's ready. Yeah, we're live on my YouTube channel. And on Facebook. Saturday Night Skincare. Just go to the channel. Um, you have to be subscribed to Jenny Love. I don't think you have to be subscribed. Yeah, I do. Though. Yes, I do think you have to be subscribed because oh. you won't get a notification about you it. Watch a live. There's a, there's, um, I will say that on YouTube, I posted a, that, we were going to be live. Mm -hmm. And so that it's not on that feed. It's like a separate feed that you end up being on. Excuse Why me. can't I see your party on Facebook? Um, we're on Facebook. We're on Two our Facebook page. Who said chicks that? bewitched. Oh, you're welcome, Misty. I'm glad. So, so, so glad that it helped your friend. Um, that's good to hear. I'm going to try to give people a couple minutes to get in too, kids. Um, see if everybody's having their technical problems. So the way we're going to work it is we're going to talk about one thing at a time, obviously. And you'll say whether you want this one thing. We will keep track of, so say we're, you know, what's our, one of our fan favorites? Liquid gold. So liquid gold, if we're talking about liquid gold, we're only talking about liquid gold at the moment. Right. And you want liquid gold, how many you want, just comment. I want one of those, I want two of those, whatever. <laughs> we're gonna keep a running list of everybody that wants liquid gold. Yes. And when we we're gonna to explain, next. Susan, we're gonna explain all the products. And no, you shouldn't send a list at the end, Cheryl, but you should keep track. And then what we'll do is we'll send everybody a bill an invoice through square through square and you can verify and you'll be able to see like what you ordered yep. and then we ship and tonight everybody it's getting free shipping if you're local and you can pick up just let us know that that yeah. we're not shipping it to you we can certainly arrange for curbside pickup but curbside pickup if you guys are around but yeah we're just good we're going to keep track we're talking about liquid gold we're going to talk about all the things about liquid gold what liquid gold is good for and then you guys can chime in and say what you want um, there really isn't, you know, I'll say if there's a limit, there's really not um, limits on things. It's not like you got to be the first one to get there or there's many of many things. Right. What you see is not all we have. And that's have not even so all of it. more made out right. in the back. Uh, hey, Lisa D. How are you, honey? So if we get to something where, yeah, that's there's only a few of, we'll let you know that, right. um, obviously. And so, <clears throat> anyway. But... Taking notes. And if you have questions, you just post the questions. We'll try to answer them as best we can. But I guess we should uh, we should get started. And my friend Suzanne, she's texting me because she can't like like I'm not like I'm not on here busy. Like she's texting <laughs> me like I you know, and I'm trying to answer her, but she's killing me. <laughs> so. Oh, uh, we don't need the phone to be unplugged. We can answer the phone. Okay. It's, we're the bosses. We can answer the phone and be live. Okay. Yeah. It's not a it's all, No, it's all good. All right. What do you want to start with? What do you want to start with? Do you want to start with, we want to start with liquid gold since we've been talking about liquid gold? Sure. Okay. It's so like I'm going to let her talk and I'm going to shout. <laughs> so liquid gold was born, oh, I would say a good five years ago um, before we opened shop. Totally before we opened shop. It was one of shop. our very first. Yeah creations and we wanted something uh low maintenance one i'm i i don't do a whole lot like in a ru regime routine skincare routine -wise. right so yeah. i need something that was versatile um and so liquid gold is an oil-based cleanser 
moisturizer, makeup remover. It's um, the best makeup remover ever. Um, we have Miss mm -hmm. Shelly, Miss V. She uses it to take the hair dye off of the scalp after she dyes hair. So Lori Beck is getting one liquid gold. Just, just to let you know, I saw her. What you know, I saw that she said that. Right. Um, Miss Jenny Love uses it as deodorant. Oh my God, I do. <laughs> I use it as deodorant. I do. So it's sort of an all-purpose uh, skin love. Um, it is hemp oil and Cheryl. sunflower oil with pomegranate seed and macadamia seed oil. Um, Cheryl, I see you. Carrot seed oil, helichrysum, frankincense, uh, infused with all the good vibes of rose quartz and Herkimer diamonds, which are both in every bottle. There's a uh, Herkimer diamond and a rose quartz floating around in there. For some extra skin love. Betty Jean protection. will take one liquid gold. Oh, hey, Betty. Hey, girl. Betty Jean. Miss you too, lady. Come back to New York sometime soon ish when you can. Put it. So it's really funny that um, it really got to this point where you could use liquid gold for a million things. Like, oh it's gosh. like a joke, like, oh, yeah. hey, weigh 732. Like, it just makes me laugh. Use it in the, I use it in the shower. Um, it's as it's like come, a shave it, when I when I do when I do shave. I was gonna say. <laughs> I was just getting to Christina. I was just funny. I was just gonna say this is this one ounce, two that ounces. Is this two is two ounces. ounces, and it's thirteen dollars. Yes, that well, I was just getting to how much it was. It's thirteen dollars. It's two ounces. One liquid gold, please, Devon Harris. When I get out of the shower, I lather my body from head to toe, literally. Um, my face, my neck, my chest, my shoulders, my, all of my body down to my toes. Um, and then I, in my soaking wet hair, I shake it out and I put a little bit in my hands and I rub some in the ends of my hair and that's it. Um, so really it's, it's my favorite. I right. think it's the one that I use the most full of all antioxidant, um, Oh geez, everything is just delicious. Antioxidants, free radicals, um, anti-aging. Right. So it's funny. I do, I do make a million immortal. Im yeah, immortal. Right. Yeah. I do make a million notes. I have my actual uh, my actual making things Bible here, so that I could actually say these things. So rosehip oil. Speaking of rosehip oil, because I know that's what we were just talking about. Yep. Uh, I had the list all the ways we love. Uh, rosehip oil. It helps reduce dullness, leave skin glowing. It's full of vitamins A and C. Vitamin A is retinol. You always hear them fancy commercials talking about the retinol. It's vitamin A. Uh, it hydrates, moisturizes, helps exfoliate, boosts collagen. The shit we like as we get older, we need more collagen. Mm -hmm. uh, reduces inflammation, helps with sun damage, helps reduce hyperpigmentation. And Joyce, that's why this worked for your sun damage. Oh, and then yes. helps reduce the scars and fine lines. So talk about that for one second. Yeah. So I have to write down people's orders. Before, Christina's going to take one. Before New York closed down, we had um, book club here one night. And our dear friend Joyce, she had been using it for a few months now and noticed that all of the... Uh, the dark sunspots, the hyperpigmentation faded away. Yeah. So all of the goodness, the rose hips, the carrot seed oil, carrot seed oil um, repairs the skin cells down at the cellular level. Um, and it's it's known and been shown, proven to uh, help reduce signs of aging. Right. And so I know there's um, helichrysum in there as well. Yep. And so that has like renewal properties. Yes. Like it helps that turnover of your, of the skin cell, um, you know, that I'm so excited about that, Cheryl. <laughs> I'm, I'm excited about, I'm always excited about liquid gold. And if I don't, I myself don't have liquid gold. I'm like, oh my God, we need liquid gold. Cause I'm like freaking out. <laughs> um, 
So, okay, so Lori Beck has two. I do have Lori Beck have that. And Janet's going to take one. And Lisa Bert Cavati. Who? Lisa. Oh, I did. Lisa Birdie. Janet. With I got Janet. All right. So here's who I got so far, just in case, you know, I missed somebody. I got Lori Beck has two. Cheryl has two. Betty Jean has one. Devon, one. Christina, one. Susan, one. Janet, one. Lisa Birdie, one. Helps with scars. Tina Chan has got vitamin E in it as well. So, yes, I've actually been, um, I've been concentrating a bit on my stomach area. I have stretch marks after having two kids. And so I have been using it on my stomach pretty religiously to see if it helps to reduce the signs of the scars. It's also the one of the oils is sunflower oil, which is really high mm -hmm. in vitamin E and that helps that too. So and then an extra added punch of vitamin right, E. Right. 13. Yes. Yes, How it's do you use it as a makeup remover, Jamie? I usually put it on like a cotton round um, or I'll put just a, a drop on my fingertips and I'll, I'll rub it into where on a Q-tip even. Yeah. Um, and then take the cotton round and sort of wipe it, uh, pat it. Well, I say wipe it, but I'll, I'll take off the excess. And so you'll know, right? When you wipe the eyes, you wipe them from the outside in. You never go from the outside out right. because then you just pull your eye, you know, and that's how we end up looking old. So we don't do that. Um, but yeah, I put it, I dilute it when I'm, and I use a, like, um, I get a, one of those cotton things and I right. just, I put a little bit of water on it and then I use it and then I just, you know, get it all off my, cause I, I wear so much crap on my face. She doesn't wear as much crap as I do. I, I use it to get all of this crap off my face. Yeah, yeah, 100%. I, I put it on a warm washcloth in the shower. That's, mm -hmm. um, so I'll, I'll wash with it. Um, and then I'll add a little bit more when I get out of the shower. Tony, yeah, no, you didn't order this in the last go around. No, you ordered calm the, calm fuck, the down. fuck down and something else. Yes. Um, but, but yes, not liquid, gold. not liquid gold. And we do have something started for you, which is why we didn't ship it because we knew you were going to be we have, so you don't pay for the shipping. So right. anyway, we'll, sh yeah. we'll ship it. So what else? What else? Oh, so then oh, we have liquid gold and, and then it's little partner, black gold. So this was born out of necessity. Um, just, I was playing with the thought of using liquid gold as I know that um, it's, it's generally good for all skin types. I know that some people might have a reaction, I guess, a reaction with using Tony. oil on their skin um, or acne prone skin. Um, thinking for, I have a teenage daughter. That was my whole purpose behind it. And activated charcoal helps to um, detoxify the skin. So I added in a little bit of liquid, a little bit of uh, activated charcoal into the liquid gold to see how that would work on my daughter's skin. Um, she has, uh, she breaks out in her hairline. Um, she's a softball player, so she's always up in her catcher's gear. And it, the activated charcoal really helps to um, dry out and draw out the impurities from the skin. So we use it a lot, activated charcoal, in a few different things that we make um, for that same purpose, detoxifying, purifying, right? help to exfoliate your skin on a microscopic level because it's so, uh, such a fine, fine part. So Jamie's going to take one black gold. I got you, Jamie. So they're, sorry, I have to go this way. It's like, I want to go this way, but. So. so it's all the goodness of liquid gold with an added detoxifier. Right. With the activated charcoal. And they're both two ounces and they're both 13 $13. So yep. we're just going to talk about those two things at the moment so that we don't get, I don't, and this is black gold for Lori. Okay. So we're going to do black gold, Jamie and Lori. Okay. I think I'm good. Meg's going to take two black gold Meg times two. Okay. Perfecto. 
Yeah, mm -hmm. activated charcoal, um, we use it in a couple of things. It definitely draws stuff out. It's yes. not like those, it's not like those, the activated charcoal masks that you see on oh all my those gosh. very, very oh my scary gosh. people pulling <laughs> oh, their faces feel... off. It's just awful. I it don't looks know. so painful. Oh. I've never tried it. I've Why watched... would anybody do that to I their skin? Know. I don't have I don't any know. idea. Why you would do that? Colleen says <laughs> one. Okay. Tina says, awesome. let me go back to Tina says one liquid gold. She says one liquid gold, one. Blah, 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 and one, one, one each. Ionics. You want one each, Tina? And then Tina. Colleen, you have to, Colleen, do you want liquid gold or, or black gold? Colleen's black gold. Okay. So Colleen. So Let's I see. have to say, I mean, not that there's a lot of buildup, but so liquid gold, the, the gold, sunflower gold. oil base is a much lighter oil. Jeez. So it's not greasy. It doesn't leave your skin greasy or oily um, in excess. You really don't, don't need a whole lot. Um, I'll put a couple squirts in my hand and I'll rub it in and it spreads uh, nicely, evenly, and doesn't leave you um, an oily mess, right. which is important. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna say that she's yeah. Tina, I got you. Tina, I got you one one of each. I got Colleen. I got Meg's taking two black golds. Jamie, Lori. So in order to keep things flowing, it just so that it's easier, we're gonna go away from the liquid golds now. If or the those black gold or liquid gold. If anybody wants either one of those, you gotta speak now. Or forever hold your peace. You don't have to forever hold your peace. You can <laughs> shout it out as you, uh, if you. But not right now. Right, not right now. <laughs> not now. We'll catch up. So you want to talk about those two? Ah, yes. Yeah, let's talk about those two. Well, let's talk about one at a time, so I'm not totally fucking confused. Go ahead. <laughs> Oh, that was what? What time are we at? See, it's a little game. 22 minutes. Jenny said the F word. I don't think I said it before now. It's pretty good for me. That's pretty good is what I'm saying. Yeah, do that one. Wicked There's Rose. One. There's that one. Wicked Rose. This is another really Jamie make it too. All right, Jamie, I got you. Say make it too. So this was another one of our very first... I remember it being on the table at the holistic market yep. when we did the outdoor. Yeah. Mary Alice's first uh, holistic market. Yes, you did. Um, this is Wicked Rose. Go ahead. You, you, you say the things. So Wicked Rose is, it's a facial toner. Um, use it after you cleanse your, your skin anywhere, uh, not just your face. Um, it's rosebuds and witch hazel and vitamin E. And we steeped, marinated the rosebuds, um, extracted all the goodness with the witch hazel and added some rose quartz for some extra skin love and vitamin E. And this is the other thing Joyce swears by, the thing yes. that, that helped her, the hi, the hyperpigmentation, the sun right. damage. Rose um, is so, so nourishing to your skin. So good. And yes. it's, it's um, toners set you up for moisturizer. So right. you wash your face and then you tone your face and then you, it sets you up. It sets your skin up for that. It says to store it in the fridge, which I do. It does smell like rose. But Susan. do you have here? It's essentially, well, it's not technically rose water because it was extracted in witch hazel, but it's form of rose water. Mm -hmm. um, it's delicious. It smells. Yeah, Lisa, beautiful. I think you got to keep it in the fridge. You can keep yeah, it in the it fridge. It smells for, really good. It's, it's totally shelf Girl's stable. However, a nice cool mist on the face definitely feels wonderful. Cheryl's so, got like one of those. So yeah, I do too. Um, it smells really good. I really like that. And yeah, after you cleanse your face, you put toner on it, it helps your face. Mm -hmm. um, so then it's little partner. <laughs> this wicked soul. This is Calendula. Infused, I got you, Susan. In she says she take one. Beautiful calendula flower and all of its golden deliciousness. I got you, Meg. Calendula is very healing for the skin. Um, helps to mend wounds. 
repair skin on the on yeah. the what's in it there's uh citrine so it's so no this one has quartz oh the quartz this the has a quartz has crystal i don't know if you can hear that inside as i'm shaking it there's a quartz right. i don't know if we mentioned a, that too there's a quartz there's in that one there's there's a rose quartz rose and quartz wicked and rose wicked rose so this is a, a rose quartz crystal elixir this is a clear quartz crystal elixir facial toner mm. or body skin toner sure you know that's another thing you use it on your face uh, I lost sound and had to go out and come back. What is this? These are facial toners. One's called Wicked Rose. Skin toners. And one is called Wicked, Wicked Soul. Soul. One is a rose base. Um, and then the other one is calendula based. Which one would you recommend for the sun damage? Uh, Wicked Rose. Yes. Lisa. I'm going to put Lisa's question up there. I think that's fun. So, yeah, Wicked Rose for the sun damage because of the rose hip oil. Right. So. <laughs> mason jars are popping. Mason jars are popping. <laughs> Things that happen in the shop. So these are both toners. Is that a toner too? Both of yes. them are toners. Yes. One with um, the rose, Lord. One with the rose and one with um, calendula. So let's see, Lori wants. Wicked rose. Wicked rose. Lisa does too. Lisa Birdie. Okay. Will it help with rosacea? Will it help with rosacea? Um, I'm testing that right now. I have to think about that. There's. I have a moisturizer that's coming up later that I do think will help with that. But it's one of the things. But I, I got a rosacea is a tricky little. Thing. Cause it's, you know, it's something like you can't go backwards, you know, not always. It's one of those things you can sort of help prevent it getting worse, but the going backwards one wicked rose, please. Victoria Hughes. I see you, Victoria. How are you, Miss Vic? So yeah, rosacea is a tricky thing, but I, there's something coming up. Um, it was one of the things on there that I, when I was creating it, I was like, I think that that would be good for that. Um, the liquid gold might actually be better for that mm -hmm. than the toner part because the liquid gold has sunflower oil in it. And that to me is one of those things that is going to help with something like that. Right. Good thing I got paid yesterday, she says. <laughs> <laughs> I would try liquid gold. Yeah, I mean, for rosacea, liquid gold is $13. So, but yeah, I think that that, that might be better because that's like um, broken capillaries. Yep. And it's hard, you know, once they're broken, it's hard to go back. Right. Okay, so Colleen wants one wicked soul and one wicked rose. She wants one of each. And you have the liquid gold. Yeah, so it's not, yeah, it's rosacea is a, tricky thing you know because it, it is damage and it's sometimes it's hard to go backwards i had one for that too yeah that's yours oh that's okay. what you wrote um colleen right colleen wants one of each Teresa holland austin wants the rose you got it gold on <laughs> what's wicked soul wicked, wicked soul, soul is, is Calendula and uh, it's calendula extracted. base, right? So wicked rose is rosebuds, and wicked soul is calendula. Teresa Holland Austin. Oh, turn them this way, so if you could see them. So one's That's just calend. That's the one I want. Or wicked one, soul. Wicked soul. Okay. Yeah, one has calendula, and one is roses that we infuse into the witch hazel. So I, I I see the wicked rose as loving on your skin, nourishing your skin, and calendula is more um, encouraging to healing your skin. Okay, so Lisa wants wicked soul. Got it, Lisa. We got it. Okay, so I think I have wicked soul. I've got Colleen, Sherbel, Lori Beck, and Lisa D on wicked soul. And then Wicked Rose, which is the rose. Cheryl, Susan, Meg, Lori Beck, Lisa, Victoria, Christina, Colleen, and Teresa. Okay. 
And that's going once, going twice. <laughs> going once, going twice. Oh, so then we should talk about the soul infusion since we just talked about wicked soul. Wicked soul. Um, no wicked rose for me, Lori Beck said. No wicked oh. rose for me. Yeah. Okay. She wanted. Oh, yeah. She's on soul. Yeah. She's not on rose. We got gotcha. you. Yeah. Just wicked soul. Oh, yeah. yeah. She was on here. Yeah. Got you. So this is Calangela infused sunflower oil mm. with a citrine crystal inside. So that's what this is. And you tell the people what you do with that. <laughs> <laughs> um, Calendula is yeah, healing, tell. skin healing. And sunflower oil is rich in vitamin E. So they're both in the sunflower family. So what Hold on, I'm sorry. Lisa, not me, Lisa, the other Lisa Wright. And you say, wait, before Lisa says, I want wicked soul. I already have the rose. Okay. So we have Lisa D that wants Wicked Soul, right? Lisa D? Yeah. Not me, Lisa, the other Lisa. I. Lisa Covati. I know I say Lisa Birdie, but no. Oh, I don't Lisa. have Lisa Birdie on here at all about any of the roses. No, no, no. Oh. She said I will take one. Oh. She's on there. But she's on the Wicked Rose. Yeah. And Lisa D's on Wicked, Wicked Soul. Soul. Yep. So we're good. And she writes, <laughs> oh my God, yes. Okay. Great. Yes, we're good. We have we have the right leases. Yes. So you talk about that. Oh, I'm going to write this down. So they're both in the sunflower family. So what better way is to infuse some sunflower oil with some calendula. Um, it's super versatile, uh, all purpose, skin healing, uh, safe and gentle on baby's skin. Um, on your four legged friend's skin. Mm. I this was this was born of a request. I had someone, one of our regulars asked if I could infuse calendula into olive oil for her, for the ears of her horses. Right. Um, to help heal with the, the ear mites. Yeah. It was the mites. Right. Yeah. Um, so calendula infused olive oil was uh, referred to her by her vet. So she came and she asked if we could do that. And we did. Um, sunflower oil though, like I said, I just liked the marriage of the two of them. Right. Together. Cause it's like sunshine in a bottle. Yeah. Complete sunshine in a bottle with, uh, infused with all the goodness of a citrine crystal, mm -hmm. um, manifestation, master manifester crystal. Right. So manifest some healing, some good love and healing. So it's anti inflammatory. Mm -hmm. Uh, calendula is really good at reducing inflammation. Um, so it would be really good, uh, you know, skin rescue, simple mm -hmm. skin rescue just to have around. It's, yeah. it's nice scars, and it's nice in, in this, in this, you know, container. Right. In a little pump top. Right. Okay. So if there are no questions, what do you want to go to next? They're all laughing at each They're all laughing at Lisa. <laughs> like, I, I said all the right things. <laughs> I said Lisa D when I met Lisa D. <laughs> oh, this is fancy new. This is new. Hot off the presses. Um, this is called Moon Goddess. If you can see that. And I'm going to, it's, it's a nocturnal um how much for the last one the soul infusion i'm sorry it's eleven dollars betty jean in a one ounce bottle and that's one ounces mm -hmm. one ounce so moon goddess is a whipped fanciness um you can't probably see i mean it's like it's like it's, whipped cream. Yeah, it's so like yeah. cheryl's like, like i want that like ah <laughs> uh, Oh, Betty Jean, let me know when you say I'll take one. Do you mean the Soleil infusion? Just only because you just asked a question about it. So I just want to make sure um, which which thing you're looking at. Here, hold on to that. Because I got notes on all of the things. How much for Moon Goddess? I'm getting there. So it's 17, <laughs> it's $17. It's in four ounces. Uh, it has a moonstone in it. And so what are all the things in it? And what are they good for? And why do I have them in there? So uh, rosehip oil, which we already talked about. Sweet almond oil, which also is high in vitamin A, vitamin E, omega-3s, zinc. And sweet almond oil actually reduces puffiness. 
it's shea butter, which is fatty acids, vitamins, anti-inflammatory healing properties. Oh, am I reading the wrong thing? Yeah, of course I am. It has those things in it. It has sunflower oil. Am I in the right place? Yeah, rose hip oil. Okay. And then it has rosemary essential oil, which increases circulation and reduces inflammation. I was really specific that I needed to have rosemary oil in this, especially as a night cream, because of the it prevents damage. And that's why I really wanted it to be not for a night thing. Frankincense eat essential oil reduces and prevents sun damage, improves tone and reduces wrinkles. Helichrysum essential oil, we talked about how it read over um, the production of cells, uh, the turnover. It smells like jasmine, which increases cell turnover. It has halang halang and rose hydrosol. Both of those things balance the oils that are already on your skin. Um, so, so for a nighttime thing, this was, if you can see it, oh, I almost had a really good picture of it, but yeah, it's super light, super light. Even the smell is super light, but yeah, it's for nighttime and it was definitely anti-aging. I mean, that's how I went into it. It was, I, I wanted it to be something for anti-aging because my fucking skin is old. <laughs> Colleen, I'll take a vat of it. <laughs> I'll take a vat of it. <laughs> yeah. And I, and it was, oh, and there's a shimmer to it. There's oh, a yeah. moon. There's like, um, it, that it's the color of mo the moon. It's this shimmer and my skin, I went home and I was like glistening. Cause I just, as I was making it and I'm trying it and I'm putting it on, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> it was hysterical. So that's moon goddess. Oh, it's sexy skin shit. Moon goddess. And seventeen dollars four ounces. My skin too. Oh, Dina! Oh my gosh! Please don't crash your car. Don't drive and listen to us. I'll take one. Oops. Sounds lovely. Yes, please, Victoria says. We're gonna have to back up. Let's see. Let me back up. I got Cheryl. We started with Cheryl. Lisa Birdie. Lisa yep. D. Yeah. Right? Lisa Birdie, Lisa B and Lisa D. And <laughs> it's a night cream, Lori, and it's definitely for your face, but it's definitely for, you know, I put it, I had it here and I had it on my hands and it was lovely. Like my hands felt so good that, you know, that whole night, they still feel really good. I, I put it on when I got here. Phaedra says two. I got, I got her okay. down for two. So Meg, Meg says one. Jamie. Cheryl, um, Colleen, I don't have a vat of it. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie wants a moon goddess. Got Jamie. Betty. Betty Jean, moon goddess. Valdo Brown says, what's up? What's up? How you doing? What's up? Right back at you. Um, where are we? Victoria, I got to Vic. She says, sounds lovely. Yes, please. Holy fuck, I'm a, I'm a sucker for anything that shimmers. I know, me too. <laughs> I know, me too. I have to go for a few minutes. Can I read about that later? Yep. Well, you can give us a call in the shop or, sure you know, shoot me a text I'll, or, you know, message on Facebook and I'll, we, you know, we're happy to answer anybody's questions about all of that stuff. Yes. So that's good. Okay. So I think that's it on Moon Goddess. We're good, right? One Moon Goddess. Devon wants one Moon Goddess. Okay. And hey, Phaedra, how are you, honey bunny? Okay, your your whipped goodness is up. All oh, right, I'll write I'll write down. So go, we're we're done with Moon Goddess. We're moving on. Did you get me, Lori Moon Goddess? Yeah. No, we did not, Lori back. Lori back. Okay. Cool. Super. Thanks, Phaedra says. <laughs> All right, so we're moving all right along to oh, this is really this one is my favorite. Sexy skin shit. Oh yeah. That's really yummy. It is. And it smells like a creamsicle. Like creamsicle. An orange creamsicle. It's got carnelian. Sexy carnelian. Um, it is nettle infused hemp oil. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -mm. So good for your skin. I can't even, I can't, I can't say so good for your skin. Yes. Yes. Super nourishing for the skin feeds. It's, it's good food for your body inside and out. Um, nettle yeah. infused hemp oil, shea butter, macadamia seed oil, pumpkin seed oil, rose hip oil, and a blend of essential oils to give it that delicious creamsicle smell. Been waiting for this. Please send two. Yes. And I know Jamie wants the sexy skin shit. Yeah. Times two. <laughs> yeah. Jamie says we'll take four. So Jamie needs four. She loves that. I know she does. It was whipped. Lori Beck. So sexy light and skin fluffy. Shit. Lori Beck says two. It's like I say it's so soft, like cashmere. Tony Basil it's says like, um, meringue. We'll take four. Cheryl. Okay. Perfect. Cheryl, Jamie, Tony, sexy shit for me. I got Tony, Lisa D. <laughs> Meg, take on. <laughs> Meg. You got it, Meg. Thank Meg. you. Let's see. I have to back up because I don't want to make sure I didn't miss anybody. So let me see. We start here. Colleen says, love it. But I don't know if that means you want one. Okay. Devon says two. Lori, Lori Beck says two. I have two. Lisa D says one. I have Lisa D. Tony says one. Jamie says four. Cheryl says one. Meg says, take all my money. Sexy skin sheet is $17. You ladies have been super busy. We've been so busy, Lori. I can't even tell you. Moon Goddess for the eyes. You know, it's not an eye serum. Um, it you might find it a little heavy. It's I mean, it's a little. It's really light. I put it on my whole face the other night before I went to bed, and it was fine. It, you know, I had it. It was fine. And I, it doesn't wash off. Right. Like, yeah. It penetrates so deeply. She had me put it on when I arrived the other day, the other evening, and I washed my hands after I went to the bathroom. My every my my hands still felt so soft. So it's really enriching. Hey Lauren, honey bunny, how are you, honey? Are you off someplace fabulous? This kid goes to the most fabulous places ever. <laughs> I want to be her in my next life for sure. So in sexy skin shit, the reason I put pumpkin seed oil is because it's rich in vitamins A and C and zinc. Um, rich in antioxidants uh, and unsaturated fatty, ac fatty acids. Um, they make pumpkin seed oil a great moisturizer for, especially for oily skin types, um, especially when you struggle with acne. Uh, the oil firms shelf the skin Dina wants has anti-aging properties. Dina wants to know what the shelf life is. So, um, you know, everything. Oil we'll, eventually will go rancid. Right. So it will. Six months, keep, keep. An this is not going to last you six months. No, it won't. It's not going mean, to last you six months. I doubt it. Yeah, I doubt it. Um, but everything, ounces. there's there's natural, what's the word I'm looking for? Preservatives in there. You know, vitamin E is a preservative. The essential oils themselves are preservatives. Um, there, there's nothing chemical about it, obviously. But they they're they're not going to go bad. Super right. fast, but yeah, if you're letting them sit around and they're not, you're not, excuse me, using them, it's there. You know, oil does go rancid eventually. Right. Eventually, you know, eventually. But I mean, they have essential oils in them, which are a type of preservative. Um, vitamin and there's e shea oil. in there too, yeah, and shea doesn't go bad either. Shea ish, you know. Yeah, it's like, mm -hmm. you know, they're not they're not going to last that long. I, I'm going to say six months because we probably have to say six months, right. but. Um, I don't think, I don't Just think Just like so. with anything, you know, you use makeup. Teresa regularly. says I'll take sexy skin shit. Teresa. Uh, is sexy skin shit a day cream? Yes, it is. It is. All Teresa over the Holland. body. Okay, so sorry I missed it. Is this a day cream? Oh, I'm sorry. We got that. I'll, Teresa says sexy skin shit. I think that's it. So let me just go over this for a second. Just so I make sure I didn't miss anybody. Uh, Devon's getting two. Jamie's getting four. Lori Beck is getting two. Tony's getting one. Cheryl's getting one. Lisa D is getting one. 
D, not lawyer, not Lisa Birdie. Meg's getting one, and Teresa Holland is getting one. And if I miss anybody, comment that you're interested in sexy Phaedra. getting one okay i don't think i missed anybody jamie says make it five got you so funny <laughs> i know listen we don't have these things all the time like that's the other thing like we make them we make that's why we make things in small batches mm -hmm. and, so, and when somebody asks for something that might have been depleted i am always has. lisa d i live to bust your balls come on <laughs> hey shelly hey witches hey witches yeah i was gonna say there's our girl right there. Are you still, she's sewing her fingers to the bone. She's making the most fabulous, you know, masks that people can buy. She's on Shades and Shadows on Facebook, if anybody's interested. And, you know, she's sewing her fingers to the bone. That's what I know. That's what I know she's doing. She's like <laughs> she's well over 300 masks sewing. or something like that. Yeah. Crazy. She's probably up to 400 by now. Easily. Like something, Easily. she hasn't stopped. Can we order online? Hey, Bridget, you know what? You can always send us a message. a message. And our Facebook, our Facebook, our website is currently under construction. I mean, I'm hoping that it's up shortly, uh, shortly, you know. But no, you can't just place an order online. So, but you can just shoot us a message. Um, tell oh, us yeah. some of the things you want. We post pictures of all of the things that we're making. And so you can at least see them and say which ones you want. And, you know, we'll get to them. What am I going to talk about? We did sexy skin shit. So that's over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So this one, I just simply called it the bomb. No EOs. There are no essential oils in this. I make, I've been making this for years and years and years. It's simply um, calendula and lavender. It's like sticking to my book. Um, calendula and lavender infused olive oil. It's, it couldn't be simpler than that. It's skin rescue, but it's skin rescue without essential oils. People are always asking us about their kids um, first aid for the kids. I'm not a proponent of essential oils on little kids skin. They're, they're, it's just too little They're You know, it, they're too volatile. I prefer not to have, you know, especially little, little ones. I mean, you can mm -hmm. use this as diaper rash, right? Um, diaper cream for diaper rash. Uh, it's for, you got to burn, you're in the kitchen, you, you know, just anything poison Ivy. Um, it's first aid, but there's no essential oils. It's super gentle. My, it's good for also really dry skin. Like I used to make this, my ex-husband said it was the only thing that worked on his hands and his hands would crack in the winter and they would get really super dry. And it was, he's like, it's the only thing that works. It was the only thing that would help him. So, and I just didn't add anything. I wanted it to be very, very gentle and simple. My, my kid used to break out over everything. Like anything we put on his skin, he broke out. So this was something that I always, I've been making this for so long. So we just wanted something very simple. What's, what is this? Oh, I'm sorry, the bomb no EOs and it's $13, it's four ounces. It's simply lavender and calendula infusion salve. You know, so it's beeswax, lavender and calendula infused olive oil. That's it, beeswax, lavender and calendula infused olive oil. It's a healing balm. There's, there's nothing. Having issues with the live stream on Facebook. Yep. You know, one for me. Faye says one for her. Yeah, it's just a, it was just very gentle and simple, especially for around kids. And, it might be and, your own internet. No issues here. Oh, okay. I got you. And pause too. Um, oh, right. Gentle enough for pause. Gentle but enough for, yeah, you're, People put it on their dog's paws before they go out to walk them in the winter for when they're going to get like they have salt out and it does, it helps to, you know, helps to crack, not, the right. Pads crack and right. Oh, I see what's happening. One bomb for Devon. Got it. Right. So somebody was saying something might have been issues, but Meg's saying she doesn't have. So maybe it's Lisa's your own internet. I get it. I get that. So yeah, the bomb, e no EOs. That was sort of my, 
my criteria. Yes. How much is that? That's $13. Shelly says I want one. Right. Got it. Shelly, of course. <laughs> <laughs> For Bella. Yeah. So it's $13, four ounces. Um, and I use green aventurine to charge it. If you can see the color of it. And it smells really good. Okay. Lisa D. Lisa D, I want one. Okay. You got it. Yep, Shelly V, we got you. All right. So Faye and Devon and Shelly and Lisa D. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Fancy. And calm the fuck down. <laughs> Yes, before somebody had mentioned when I said it was 22 minutes that I hadn't said I hadn't said the F word, but she reminded me I said calm the fuck down. I don't know if saying that matters counts because it's the name of one of our most beloved products. It's calm the fuck down. You got um, it, Phaedra. One more moon goddess for Phaedra. Okay. I got you. And my daughter's so skin has total. been breaking out. Let's hear. We have a we have a question. My daughter's skin has been breaking out ever since she had her babies. Her skin is breaking out ever since she had her babies because her hormones are going like this. Yep. So it's an internal thing. She needs internal balance. Um, nettles. Right. So I tell her to drink nettles tea. Um, right. I tell her to drink nettles tea. I probably tell her to take CBD. Is she breastfeeding? What mm -hmm. is she doing? I mean. One fuck for Lori. <laughs> one fuck for Lori. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that made me laugh. <laughs> she, well, I guess she had, you know, she has, she's got a fuck there. There are some fucks she has. One fuck for Lori. Okay, where were we? Um, nettles. Okay, thank you. Yes, she's breastfeeding. So she should check with her doctor before yes. she takes anything, ingest anything. You need to make sure it's good. There's also something called motherwort. And that'll balance her, which might balance her skin because it's really it's just well, it's just what's happening inside really. right it's not it's on the outside it's on the inside <laughs> so for sure so yeah i would definitely check with her on that my fave calm the fuck down right calm the fuck down is everybody's fave right so this is a this is also a skin rescue um do we have pictures from tony tony oh my gosh yeah right so tony's like <laughs> hang on i'll We'll up. get the pictures. So this Holy is cow. a plantain salve. And it's also got tea tree essential oil in it. It's, I can't believe I don't have the, this is the old, you know what you grab? This is, this is Tony's. I know I changed this. I put what? the, I put the, um, oh. the ingredients on there. Oh, I was one of the uh, yes, samples. It was right. Right. Yeah. The new one is up there. Oh yeah, I changed it. So it's plantain infused olive oil and tea tree oil, beeswax. And we charge it with a black tourmaline when we're making it and Himalayan salt. And it's great for all the wounds, <laughs> all the poison ivy, eczema, psoriasis, um, people swear by it. People send us emails about what, what this does. We used to teach it. First of all, we, I tell the story all the time because it makes me laugh. This was the, we used to make a kit. It was one of the first two things on our table. It was an elderberry syrup kit and a plantain salve kit. Yep. We couldn't give it away. Oh my people. gosh. We no. couldn't, we couldn't give it away. Then we taught a class. We were like, oh, let me teach you how to make plantain salves like, and what they're good for. We would have people come in. And again, I think we had one person show up who is our friend for life, Miss Victoria. And <laughs> she comes all the time. She's one of our best friends and our one of our people. And we had one person show up. And then we made this and we can't keep it on the shelf nope. because it is that good. Like right. as we were trying to explain to people for, for four years, we just kept trying to tell them. So we're like, all right, let's just make it for them. So it's we, your all purpose skin healing, 
antibacterial, antifungal, right. all the good shit. Right. Um, and if you have psoriasis or eczema, I will tell you, here. I tell people, she posted them. Oh, here they are. This is um, somebody who's watching. This is her psoriasis. I don't know if you can see. Oh, that glare is horrible. And my screen protector is completely shattered. I'm sorry. Okay. okay, so on our Facebook page here, with, if I was way more techie savvy, I could just pull them right up and show hey, them Shay. to you. Hey, Shailene, how are you? Beautiful. Let me see. What page was that on? Because I'll see if I can show. That was our page. All right. So two chicks. How far down is it? Uh, just below. It was yesterday. At okay. Not far at all. A couple below your video from this morning. Look at where I stop. Terrible. All right. Two for Lisa. Welcome back, Susan. So can you see poor Tony's neck? This Psoriasis. is the before. This is the before picture. Right. Here's the after. It's remarkable. And that's that's and that's not her most recent picture she, she sent, sent us, us another picture she sent picture us today. current pictures that was that photo was from yesterday and there's even an improvement here's today. her arm you can see her arm is also a remarkable i, I don't want to get too much glare and then her arm it's gone in this picture it's gone um it's crazy so do you want me to back up here Lisa times two, Cheryl. Let's see. We started with the one fuck for Lori. Yes. Right? That's where we started. Lori, one fuck for Lori. One fuck for Lori, two fucks for Lisa D. <laughs> Lisa D takes a fuck. One for Betty Jean. Uh, figure that would one make you Cheryl. laugh. Cheryl said she's taking a fuck. Uh, yeah, we got Lisa D's. I'll take one. Oh, actually, Lisa D, make it two, she yep. says. One for Betty Jean. That's more like it. <laughs> My dad. Hey, dad. My dad. I could use some of that cream. Yep, I'll bring you some, dad. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yes, definitely, Shay. One for Shay. So no, she no, no. writes. She says, this sounds like it would be a good good for hands that are washed a lot and rough yes. and antibacterial. Yes. 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 Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. I sent one to Meg. One for Shay. Um, oh, dad's cute. <laughs> He's cute. All right. So I think we got Lori, Lisa D's times two, Betty Jean's getting one, Cheryl's getting one, Shailene's getting one. Mm -hmm. That's on the calm the fuck down. I love this sab. It saved me. I love that you said that. Yeah. And I also tell anybody, if they're having this sab, they should also, I know we're going to say it a million times, also drink nettles tea. Yes, the two Lori. the two things in combination, really, because anything that's going on on your skin, I mean, short of a fungus on your skin, anything that's going on Which, on your skin is coming from inside. It's right. a barometer for what's happening on the inside which is why we spend so much time trying to help people on the inside because really if you have this psoriasis yes it shows up topically but it's it's coming from the inside it's something going on inside you have to figure that out and one of the things that's really good to help that is nettles and so you're drinking that and it's sort of getting rid of things and then it's not that that toxin's not coming out in your skin and then yes this will help that um so it's like a double punch to it mm -hmm. It's really good. Yes. Did you get my two fucks? Yes. We did get your two fucks, Lori. We did. <laughs> <laughs> we did. <laughs> She's so funny. All right. So, oh, you want to do scrubs, the baths? Yeah. Um, let's do those. And then there's the other one that's not here. Where's the other one? Here. All right. I'm on it, she says. Okay, so that's it for Calm the Fuck Down. I just want to oh. make sure we're all good. Miss Marie is too, nettle Lori. tea. Okay, yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. That was my favorite. 
So we have a bunch of scrubs and salts and fanciness. So I'm gonna start with one that we've had. Um, this is, so in the liquid gold family, right? We make that liquid gold. We started that with that in the beginning. So we took liquid gold. Because and we, we use it for so many things. And so Jenny many Love, things. She transformed it. So this is a coffee scrub. Uh, it's called Colombian Gold. And it's also got coconut oil and coffee. And why? Why? This is an exfoliator. I use this on my face. Uh, you could use it every day. But d d definitely two times a week that do I use this on my face um, to exfoliate. It's a gentle way to exfoliate. It mm -hmm. also tightens your skin. It's temporary, but it, caffeine does tighten your skin. Mm -hmm. um, but all the things that is in liquid gold is also in this and then coconut oil and um, which is brew. Right, which is brew um, coffee. coffee grinds. And then love it. I use it on my face as a scrub, right. That's, this is how I use this is on your face. So there are, uh, there's only probably four or five of these. This is $15. It uh, comes in this reusable pouch. And damn it, I got lost again. What are you selling? She says, damn it, I got lost again. Lisa D, she really is a problem. She really needs her handheld tonight, doesn't she? <laughs> we love you. <laughs> Coffee scrub. It's liquid gold turned into a scrub. It's called Colombian Gold. It's $13. And it smells gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. It smells so delicious. It's so good. It's like a latte. It's yummy. Uh, I'll take one. Meg's going to take one of these. Candice is going to take one of these. Lisa, I'm not sure if you're just saying yes about the hand holding or you're interested. Oh, she said she'll take one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so yeah, those, those are really good. And I use that all the time on my face. You know, that's, that's one of the things that goes on my face all the time. Yeah. She came in one day. She's like, you know, that liquid gold, I found another use. <laughs> yes, I did. I added coffee to it and put it in my shower. <laughs> yeah. I took coffee and I took that and I have this tub of it and I, I use it. I mean, I'll use it anywhere. But it is from mainly for my face because it really it's really good for your face. So okay. I use it all over my body because it's yeah. a great exfoliator. It's so yeah. gentle, um, super fine ground, like espresso grind, coffee yeah. beans. Super so, gentle. Super gentle. So the, the other <laughs> scrub that we have is called Sweet Rose. This looks like chia pudding. And it's such so a beautiful pink. This is this is that Alea sea salt. Yes. And so yes, it is Lisa. Good for cellulite coffee, caffeine. Yeah, because it it does tighten. I mean it does. I want a sweet rose, she writes. So that that salt is really really good for you. So where is that? Sweet rose. So that salt it's Hawaiian salt. It has 80 trace minerals in it. It contains electrolytes. It can be absorbed through the skin. So as you're using it, your, your skin will absorb the benefits of that salt. That's what gives it the red color. Um, this has a shimmer to it also. I made this a shimmery. I know Lisa says I'm a sucker for the shimmer. So am I. So I made this one shimmery too. But it's um, the benefits from the minerals in this salt can be absorbed through the skin. And it promotes a smooth complexion. All you guineas, you're all gonna know what I'm talking about when I say this. You know that chicken skin that you that you get? Yes. This. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I love this sparkle. I do. I love the sparkle too. So Lisa's taking one. Christina. Um, frat, did you write her last yes, name down? Yeah, because I won't remember that. Uh, Lisa wants one. The Sweet Rose, is it a face scrub? I would say you could use it on your face, but it was not, it, it's, it's, I ground the salt to a fine powder, I did, but it's got, um, yeah, I'm gonna say no. Jamie wants a Sweet Rose too. Yeah, I'm gonna say no only because it's, I think it's a little heavy. It, you know, it's not like it's gonna harm your skin. Anything in it, it's all natural, it's fine. It just might be a little heavy. I think this is more for your face. It's a finer grind. Columbian gold. Yeah, the Columbian gold, I, I feel is more for your face 
because of the fact that it's the oils are a little thinner and there's less stuff in that. And it's, I think it will cause, you know, but this has shea butter in it, which not that there's anything wrong with shea butter. I just think that this with the salt, um, there's also a blackberry fragrance. It's an all natural fragrance, but I, I'm just saying no. That's how I feel about it. <laughs> saying no. This one was meant for a body polish. It was really the way I meant it. I'll take Colombian too. So Jamie's taking a sweet rose. Susan Doonan is taking a sweet rose also. Awesome. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. Last but not least, this is Dark Goddess. It comes in two sizes. It comes in a $15 pouch and an $8 pouch. Uh, Colleen says sweet rose, please. Colleen, me too, and the Colombian. Colleen says Colombian and sweet rose. How much, Tony? How much for what? Sweet rose. Sweet rose. Sorry, $10. This one's $10. This is one's Colombian. $15. Um, Colleen, Janet says one sweet rose. I'll give everybody a minute. I won't move on yet. Colleen, you want one of each. Got her. Okay. All right. One sweet rose for Janet. Yeah. So Dark Goddess, the large pouch is 15, the small pouch is eight. This is to release negative attachments. It's for protection. It's cleansing. It's a black salt. It's for your bath. Um, which is black it. bath salt. It's which is black bath salt. I'm going to put some in my hands. So you can see as it's going on my computer. <laughs> that. So... There's juniper in it. It's, um, it's dead sea salt, Epsom salt, activated charcoal, mugwort, juniper, lemon peel, lemon essential oil, and a smoky quartz crystal. This is, Shailene wants a dark goddess. Tony wants a dark goddess. Colleen wants a large. Shailene wants the small. Lisa D wants one large black goddess and one black gold. <laughs> okay. When you say black gold, do you mean do you mean the toner or the scrub when you say one black goddess and one black gold? Lisa. Colombian gold is the java scrub. Black yeah. gold is the black gold is the toner. The activated charcoal liquid gold. Hey, uh Bridget I'll get back to Dark Goddess in just a second. I just want to make sure that we get everybody. We're all caught up. So Lisa D. One black gold is the toner. And Colombian gold is the scrub. So I'm not sure which one. The other shit, like the act, yes. So she she does want the black gold. Yes. Okay. Got it. Thing we talked about ages ago. I just want to make sure we're on the same page. So Dark Goddess, it's a bath salt. It's a detox. So you would take a tablespoon and add it to warm bath water. And magically and medicinally, it's proper. And I mean by that is it's going to do, like, it's thoughtful in the manner that Activated charcoal is going to help detox you. And so is the Epsom salts. And dead sea salt is so good for your skin if you're soaking in some dead sea salt. And Lisa Birdie, yeah, I'll be sending an invoice. Yes, love. That's how I'm doing it. I'm sorry. I'll see you later, honey. Thanks. So it's, um, it's to get rid of. It's to release. Uh, that's what it's geared for. It's really good. It smells amazing. It smells so crisp and fresh. And yes. um, you got dark, you got my dark goddess, right? Lisa, Lisa D. D. Yeah. Yes. Okay. 
I so there's D and Tony for Dark Goddess. Shailene wants the small. Yeah, let's go back. I'm just gonna go back a bit. That's where I started. Thank you. Colleen wants a large. Tony wants a large. Lisa would like a nettle repo. Also. Um, Shailene wants a small. Got it. Bridget, you probably could make it a body scrub. You know, you could change it into a body scrub with the activated charcoal. Um, that might be a bit messy. <laughs> We hate activated, you working with activated charcoal, my God. There is no way That's not dry. to get activated charcoal everywhere. There's no way. Oh, when you're, right. When, when you're, you're working with, when it, you're working with it, it. In this? Not so much. Not so much. Uh, keep me out of trouble. Tony wants a dark goddess. Got it. She wanted a large dark goddess. Lisa, Lisa you got my... How much do you use for one bath? Like a tablespoon. You know, you don't need much of it. A scoop, you know, it's, uh, we're not, we don't need to measure, you know, it's just a scoop of it. This right. is the large is, you know, it's probably, I don't know, six, right? I'd say six different, six different ones. How much more. do you use for one bath? Yeah. You just like a little scoop in there, you know, until you feel like it's good. I would dub this, I, this is definitely four or more baths, this one. And so the large is 15 and the small is eight. Thank you so much, Lisa. Have a great night. Dark Goddess, there are, you can have what you want, a small one, Shelly V. Uh, I think they're all, yeah, they're all left. So either, I think, I think. I wrote it down for large. Shelly, yeah. You I, a large yeah, we're, you're fine. That's fine. You're fine. I have activated charcoal capsules. I made it with Marita, but I'm scared to swallow them. I got you down, Susan. Susan wants a small. Yep, okay. All right. So we have small Shailene and Susan. And then for the large, Lisa D, Tony B, Shelly. I think Colleen said she wanted a dark goddess also. Uh, may keep me out of trouble, she writes. So yeah. Yeah. Well, large one for me. Colleen Sherbel. Awesome. Got it. Okay. You get to talk about. Shelly said small is fine. Okay. So you get to talk about face masks. So I think. Clays. We're talking about clays now, kids. You want to talk about that one? I'll talk about that one. Yeah. yeah. So, well, we'll just lead activated charcoal into right into detox 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 is activated charcoal bentonite clay together um powerhouse detoxifier skin cleanser um it's a great mask uh you can add in for your skin type um any of uh, spring water uh, apple cider vinegar Fresh local honey, liquid gold, liquid gold. Um, I paint it onto my face. I let it sit for ten minutes. This container, Lisa, the price on Detox, forever. it's thirteen dollars, and this container itself. I don't know. Is there twenty ma masks in here? Like these, ten masks, at, maybe at twenty, least, at least ten, and then spot treatments, yeah, for blemishes. Um, I'll use it. You know, in spots, I'll just dampen a little bit. I'll I'll scoop a little bit out of the out of the bottle and add a little bit of water, or vinegar, um, or a dollop and dollop of honey. Lisa D wants two of these. Okay. So the good thing about clay masks is when you you put them on, you know, you you just need to make a paste. Um, Cheryl wants one too. And you paint them on, they're going to draw out the toxins. That's what they're going to do. They're going to draw toxins out of your face. That is a total topical, you know, dirts and toxins and all kinds of crap on your face. The thing to remember about clay masks is don't let them dry to cracking. Right. Don't let them, don't, you don't want them to be so dry that they've cracked. That you can't move your face. They should be shimmery a little bit, still a little bit of moisture. And then you wipe them with a warm washcloth. 
Um, I'll take a detox. It's a good back facial, good armpit yeah. facial, yeah. or I say facial, but cleanser, detox. Yeah. To detox. Yeah, Victoria Hughes wants one. Um, yeah, there it's that that's a good thing about clay masks, and that's what they'll do. They're really good, they're really good. Um, and that is $13. And this is a two ounce container. You just shake it up, mix the two things until they're all mixed up. Um, but those are really good. Those are like really good. It looks cloudy. Looks like the fog is settled in. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. Yeah, you talk about that one. So this oh, guy here. Ignorant. Why detox your armpits? Hold on. Here's a good one. Why detox your armpits? Um, if you sweat excessively, if you use deodorant on the regular, um, if you have foul pits, uh, an armpit detox is good to do. Um, helps to dry out the toxins that are creating the odors. Um, yeah, especially yeah. I, I know like a with using natural deodorants, um, a detox every so often is always good. Make it too. Or shows. Let's make it too. with any. Do you why is why is it not good to let let it dry until it cracks? It's just it's not good for your skin. It's um it's almost like you've le you've left it on too long and now you have to peel it off your skin. It's not that's why those stupid peels like it's it's not your skin's not meant for that. Right. And so it's still working as it's drying, but you don't you don't it's, need it to dry onto your face. It's sort of counterproductive right. because you're you're using a mask to help heal your skin or. Right. Um, do you, you, you want to be able to get, you want to be able, right. It. You want to be able to get it off that it's not now, now it's, you know, now lived into your skin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You just don't let it dry till it's cracking. That's right. not you just till it's shimmery. Listen, it's not, it's not like it's going to stop working or not. You know, it's just, it's, it's, it's done at a certain point. You know, it's, you don't need to go any further with that. Sorry, kids. It was time for a break. Okay. So we have some orange clay. This is this is clay that I collected um, down in South Carolina when we collected amethyst last January from the Purple Heart Mine. So this is the clay, the dense, sticky clay that we pulled out of the amethyst crystals, um, brought it home. We packed it up, filled up a container of it, and brought it home and washed it and uh liquefied it let it settle we cleaned it and skimmed it um hung it dry in organic sure uh, to sack to let it dry and then ground it to a powder to be used as um a mask all full of all of the good amethyst bars. charging this yeah. yeah so that's really good i love that so we've got that in, we've got right. the full shot and the half shot. And I didn't give this a name because I don't know what to name it. <laughs> I, Amethyst. Amitrine. Transcend <laughs> bullshit. Transcend the bullshit. That's yes. a great word. I mean, a great title. I love it. Perhaps. I like it. Maybe so, you want, how much are those? Um, five and seven. Got five that. for the small. Full shot. Large. Cheryl's like full. I don't want any any of these half shot <laughs> nonsense. Cheryl's like, no, I need a full shot. Thank you very much. Lori Beck wants a full shot. That's like a one ounce and a two ounce. How much? Uh, seven dollars for the full shot. Full. Colleen says full. I reckon it's Lisa D. I recommend the full shot. <laughs> She's hysterical. Christina. Okay, she wants a full shot. Cheryl, that's right. Betty Jean. Cheryl sure, like three. Okay, so did I get Tony? Tony wants two. Uh, Betty Jean, Cheryl, Christina, Jamie. All right. So let's see. Colleen, make it two. 
So I'm going to go down the list just so that we don't get lost here. Cheryl's getting three. Lori Beck is getting one. Colleen's two. Christina's getting one. Betty Jean's getting one. Lori B. Tony B. I'm sorry, is getting two. And Jamie. Tony is times two. I have you two at full. Nobody wanted a half shot, so everybody's getting the full. What is the name? What is it made of? Oh, go ahead, explain that. Jamie missed that. Oh, Jamie, it's clay that I collected from the Amethyst Pocket down in the Purple Heart Mine in South Carolina last January. So this has been living with amethyst crystals for its whole life. For its whole life, living with amethyst crystals. Yes. Hello. Embedded in the amethyst crystals. <laughs> It was so sticky. I love it. I love it. Nice. Okay. So I got Cheryl three, Lori one, Colleen two, Christina one, Betty Jean one, Tony B two, and Jane. Okay. You are awesome. She is awesome. No, you are. <laughs> okay. Last but not least, and we'll go back over a couple of things if anybody wants us to revisit stuff. Um, this is called Pretty in Pink. And this is Pink Clay. Oh, Phaedra wants a full one too. Got it. So this is called Pretty in Pink, and this is French pink clay. Same. Um, this is more for, when I say more for sensitive skin, if your skin tends to not like things, if it doesn't, Lori, B, uh, Lori Beck wants two shots. So if your skin doesn't like things, mine tends to be on the sensitive side. Like I just, things end up bothering me. If I use the same thing a lot, like, or if it's too heavy, it's just my skin doesn't like it. So the le less is more for me. And so I use the pink clay is the one that I use. Um, it's same. You do the same thing. You know, there's probably 10 facials in here. It's a lot in here. My niece will call me. She'll send me a picture of the empty bottle. And she's like, I need the stuff. <laughs> like, she's just like, it's, she was starting to break out all over and she's got sensitive skin. And so this is, this is the thing she loves. You can do spot stuff with it too, same, but it's definitely, this was more on the sensitive skin. Can I switch to pink? Of course. Um, it's more for the sensitive skin and it's the same. Clays, you find them and they just draw toxins out of your face. You know, mm -hmm. and I will say anybody, Lisa D wants two pink ones too. Excuse me. Anybody that um, uses clays should know that when you do use a clay, and you do a mask, you will get like a red sort of flush when you're done. Don't freak out. Because it did, it just, it's like it pulls everything to mm -hmm. the top, you yeah. know? Get a cool washcloth. Yeah, just you get Lay cool, back. Right. And just enjoy it. Yeah, because it does. It, it's pulling everything out. So you may, it, it gets red. It, you know, sometimes people think they did something wrong or it's too much. That's pretty normal. It's not. Um, I need to go, but can you add my favorite essential oil roller to my order? Yes. I know exactly what she means. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Be well. Oh, okay. Gotcha. You got it, Betty. Thank you so much for stopping in and hanging. And So I just want to make sure that, you know, you know that when you get a clay, like that's what happens. And, you know, I don't, I don't want people to freak out when they're using it because that's not, that's pretty normal. That's, you just pulled everything to the top. Right. So thank you, Betty Jean. So that's it for our products tonight. If one anybody for... has any one pink for Trin, please. Yes, this Trinity has to have it. I totally agree, Miss Victoria. I totally agree. Um, it's perfect for teenage skin. My son, we have. I don't have any left. There's a green clay. Um, the green clay, clay is more for oily skin, which we don't have any at the moment. And that's the one that I gave to my son who didn't quit. I think I want to add liquid gold to my order. Yes, of course, Miss Shay. Of course that can happen. We're going to go back over some things. Um, we're not going away just yet. So, cause we have some housekeeping too at the end to tell everybody, I need everybody to send me their email addresses if I don't already have it. Um, but I gave, he started working at the mall and in the pretzel joint and he just, breathes in grease all day long. And my kid who never had a blemish on his face all of a sudden was starting to break out terribly. And he's like, I start working at this place and now I'm totally broken out. And so that's, I got the green and he just puts it because he doesn't need it anywhere else, but he needs, what's the roller thing? 
It's um, be it's well. the be well roller. You it's know, a, it's a a wellness roller, a wellness blend of essential oils. It's oregano oil and frankincense and sunflower oil and rosemary. I was gonna infused say infused with frankincense tears and bloodstone and amethyst for wellness, general wellness. We usually have it hanging around here. We don't have any hanging around here at the moment. But um I can whip it up for her. Just gonna whip it up. Yep. So yeah, so any clays, they're you know, that's they're really good to for getting the toxins out of your skin. So we don't have any. Obviously, we've all been cooped up and want to spend our fucking money. <laughs> yeah, we just bought, we just bought. This oh my is, God. And I told some of you, some so of you excited. have listened to me talk about this. We just bought a, a copper still to make our own hydrosols and essential oils. How Maybe not essential is that? oils, but we just bought our own. And it's, I can't wait. It's gorgeous upon itself. But yeah. So talk about sitting around spending money. I texted her and I was like, we're buying this thing. <laughs> and she's like, okay. So we'll be making our own hydrosols and things. I'm very, I think I need it shipped because I don't get close to you these days. Yep, Shailene, that's all good. We're shipping. It's free shipping tonight. If you want it shipped, we're going to. So here's the, before we go back over things, let me tell you the, um, let me tell you the, the house rules. If I don't have your email address, and there are people on here that I know that I do not have your email address. So to be safe, if you feel like I don't, and you know that I don't, or you want me to have your email send address, send us a message. Send us a, a, um, a Facebook message. And if you're not on Facebook, then send us an email at two chicks bewitched at yahoo.com. So all one word, two chicks bewitched at yahoo.com, or send us a Facebook message. Hey, Keith Hoyt. Everybody, Mr. Roguich, Mr. Roguich, everybody. Um, <laughs> Make two chicks vodka. You know, I know. Sean Wilson. We will be. Sean Wilson's watching this whole thing it's and he chimes in, in about the booze. <laughs> it's all in our grandmaster plan. Believe me, I'm so excited. I went to go buy hydrosols. They were so fucking expensive that I'm like, well, I just, just making our own, goddammit. Yep. So that's what we're doing. So, so we're gonna make our own hydrosols and make yes. the vodka to make the tinctures. The tinctures. So exciting. <laughs> anyway, it's very exciting. Hi, Mr. Roguich. Hey, Lisa D says, hi, Mr. Roguich. All the juniper, all the gin. Yeah, so we're very excited. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, so let's talk about spending money. So that's what we do. So if there's anything anybody wants to see, wants to go over, I just want to make sure that I got everybody's stuff. Um, if you think, Cheryl Sprague says, Mr. Rogue. <laughs> I'll buy straight. Nobody's buying any vodka from us. This is an illegal process. So I don't break the law. I don't break the law. So we're not making any vodka. We're certainly not selling any vodka. So <laughs> that's not what's happening. I just need, I, there was somebody else. Janet, could you, we don't could anybody. you add a bottle of CBD? We are completely out of CBD at the moment, Janet. When I get it, I will definitely let you know for sure. I will definitely put that on your list there. Shailene. One pink for Trinity for Victoria. Yes. Hughes. She wants pink. And so if you get your bills, can you add the bug spray stuff that I purchased before? Yep, Faye, we will do that. Yes, I know what she's talking about. Um, just put bug spray next to Faye's. We do, I didn't get to that yet, but I'll, I'll do that this week. Um, and we haven't need two chicks vodka. I love it. Yes, Jamie, I do love it too. But that would be breaking the law, the uh, you know alcohol and tobacco industry. Somebody might be mad. I don't know. I'm just saying. <laughs> so if when you get your invoice, if there's anything on it that you didn't order or anything on there that or not on there that you did order, just send me back a message and we'll just fix it. Uh, I'll be calling or messaging you. I need other stuff. Yes, you do. Okay, I tell me. We'll talk about it. So if anybody else has any questions. Yeah, Lisa D. She says, fuck them. Right, because it's not, you're not going to prison. Right, fuck them. Just make that vodka, Jenny Love. Fuck them. She's going to prison. She'll go to prison. It's like when we make our little, be like the moonshiners. Our little, right. Maybe we can get a show. Which, which you moonshiners? Sanitizer? Oh, yeah. Do you have the hand sanitizer? If yes, please add to my order. We do not, because we don't even have the essential oils that make it. No. 
when I was out and about today, I found aloe. I know, but we don't have the, we don't have the essential oils. That's mm -hmm. the problem. Yeah. Right. We don't have, um, we'll send a message with my email address. Yeah. Devon, send a message with your email address. And then what we'll do is we'll send you an invoice. <laughs> No, Christina, calm the fuck down, vodka. She said, "No, it'll be called chill the fuck out." Chill the fuck out. <laughs> chill the fuck out. Exactly. With an accompanying smoking blend. Oh yes. Hmm. Yes. Calm the fuck down, vodka. Well, if nobody has any questions or didn't need to add anything to their order, I thank you very much for joining us. We love doing these. We think they're super fun. Yeah. I feel like you know people learn some stuff and what we do and why we do it. Love you chicks. Time for Beltane fires. Yes, I indeed. Know. It totally is. I'm yep. going home, getting in my hot tub. Same. We're lighting a fire. Yep. We might smoke some things. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Rogue was like, God damn it. That's what he's thinking. I'm making a basket for my mom. Mother's day cleanser. I'm making a basket. Oh, cleanser. Cleanser. Do you mean gold? for the face? We have a liquid gold cleanser. It's an oil-based cleanser. Fay hey, Faye, this is a, it's a, it's liquid gold. It's an oil-based cleanser. Um, it's light. It's gentle. Sunflower oil-based. Sunflower and hemp oil is the base. Um, yes, to go with the cream. Yes, okay. Yeah. Got it. This is, uh, this is the one. Because you can take off your makeup with it. Mm -hmm. You know, if you need a foam, it's not this. Like, people that need that foam, but... This is, I wash my face with this. Soap never touches my face. It's this. Mm -hmm. So. On a washcloth, on a wet, warm washcloth. Yeah. It's, it's good. We like that. Yes. All right. Perfect. She's got dry skin. Ah, yeah. So this is really good. Yeah. Hey, please add liquid gold for me. I'm close to being out. Lisa D wants liquid gold too. Got it. All right. All right. This was fantastic. Victoria Hughes, we have to get in the same room you, someday, Victoria. damn it. Yeah, this was fun. It's super fun. We love making this stuff and we love bringing it to you. You know, skin good skincare doesn't need to be that hard. We conspire all the time. We we're do. always we're <laughs> back and forth brainstorming. We do. We do. And I love it when a plan when a plan comes together. <laughs> There's actually two products that didn't make it to the floor today because we didn't get to finish them. Right. But we'll put them on Facebook. Soon. You know, soon if anybody's interested. Yep. We have another uh sexy skin shit flavor yeah. coming. And another bath salt coming. Yes. So that was the whole thing. So we just didn't we just didn't get to them. We were working our little fingers to the bone. Yep. But if there's anything anybody else needs, let us know. Shoot us a message. Tell us. Tell, Tell us. us. Well, they both have Beltane notes and mm. earthy notes. Yeah. We'll just say that. And then, you know, next time around, what's the sexy what's the sexy skin shit? We, sexy skin shit is the whipped body butter. It's a whipped body butter. <laughs> Come on. Jesus. Where were you? What happened? <laughs> sexy skin skin shit is a it's a it's now like, infused. Nettle infused hemp oil with it. pumpkin seed oil. Look how and, whipped it is. Uh, it's gorgeous. It's like luxurious. a little cloud and it yeah. smells like a creamsicle. a creamsicle. Yeah, you bought that. That's the sexy skinship. Yes. All right, my loves. Well, we thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We hope you're all staying safe. Yes, you did. No, I bought that. Yeah, you yeah. bought it. I hope you're all staying safe. And and. Practicing physical distancing. Be Unlike safe, us. Be well. <coughs> Unlike us, you can't manage to stay more than two feet apart. <laughs> yes, we know we are not being socially distant. We understand. Susan we know. would like sexy skin shit too. Yeah, sexy skin shit is lovely. You got it, Susan. All right. All right, my little chickens. Well, I thank you. I hope I you're all you. staying safe. This was fabulous. This was fabulous. We thank you very much. And we'll be getting invoices out between today and tomorrow. And if there's anything that needs to be sort of made, Tony, we know we'll talk to you at a, at a later date. <laughs> we'll talk to you about what your order is at some point. Um, if there's a question, you can always call us to Chicks Bewitched. Uh, it's 845-839-0585. You can always leave a message. If you have a question, question about anything you saw, just give us a call. We're happy to talk to you guys. So 
Love you guys. Thank Love you, you guys. so much. Ah. Peace. <laughs>